Hello friends, welcome back to the tutorial. Suppose we have four regular expressions A, B, C and D. Then the regular set corresponding to the regular expression A will contain only a single element. That is A. Similarly, regular set corresponding to this regular expression B will also have a single element B. Here the regular set corresponding to these regular expressions are written. Right. Now we have to find the regular set corresponding to this regular expression A plus B. First of all see that regular set corresponding to the regular expression A is set having one element A and this set corresponds to this regular expression B. Then the regular set corresponding to this regular expression A plus B will be the union of these two sets. Right? So this will contain only two elements A and B. Now look at this second expression AB. Again regular set corresponding to regular expression A is this one set having only one element that is A. Similarly for regular expression B this is the regular set for regular expression B. Now the regular set corresponding to this regular expression AB would be the concatenation of these two sets. That is the set whose strings are formed by concatenating the strings of this set with the strings of this set. So only one string will be formed that is AB. Right? Now look at this regular expression A plus B and then C plus D. Here regular set corresponding to A plus B will have two elements. A, B, right? And regular set corresponding to this regular expression will also have two elements that is C and D. So this regular expression represents the concatenation of these two sets, right? And that set which corresponds to this regular expression will contain following a string right actually it uh, the regular set of this uh, regular expression which is represented by this regular expression will contain strings which are formed by concatenating the string of this set with the string of this set that is a c a d b c and B, D, A, C, A, D, B, C, B, D. We can say this regular expression represents the set of all strings whose length is 2 and whose first symbol is either A or B and second symbol is either C or D. Right? Now look at this regular expression. A plus B represents a regular set. A, B, C represents a regular set C and B plus D represents a regular set having two elements B, D. Now the regular set represented by this regular expression will have set of strings which are formed by concatenating which are formed by concatenating three strings. Right. First strings should be from this set, second string should be from this set and third string should be from this set. So first string could be either A or B, second string should be C and third string could be either B or D. So it would be A, C, B, A, C, D, B, C. B and B, C, D. We can say that this regular expression represents 
a set of strings which have only three symbols where first symbol could be either A or B and second symbol should be C and third symbol could be either B or D and uh, this regular expression represents a set of strings whose length is 3 means all those strings which have only three symbols first symbol could be either A or B second should be C and third could be either B or D now look at this regular expression right A clean first of all regular set corresponding to this regular expression A will have only one element that is A then the regular set corresponding to A clean would be the clean closer of this set that is A clean closer so this set will include empty string and all those strings which can be formed by the string of this set A right so it will be A double A triple A and so on it will be a infinite set right now see A B clean first of all look at the regular expression A B now the regular set corresponding to it will contain only one string that is AB. Now AB clean would be would represent a regular set which would be the clean closer of this set that is the clean closer of set having one string that is AB. So this regular expression represents a regular set whose strings are empty and all strings which can be formed by this string AB that is AB AB two times AB three times and so on it will also be an infinite set right next is A plus B clean first of all find the regular expression corresponding to A plus B it would be Sorry, first of all, find the regular set corresponding to the regular expression A plus B. So the regular set corresponding to this regular expression will contain only two elements, A, B. Now A plus B clean will represent a regular set which would be the clean closer of this set. That is A, B clean closer. Right? And it will contain a string empty string and all strings which can be formed by A and B that is A B double A double B A B A A B B all combinations of A and B so it will also be an infinite set now Suppose we have to write a regular expression representing a set of strings whose second symbol is A, right? Where sigma means set of input symbols of any uh, some finite automata is A and B. It means we have to use only these two symbols when we form a regular expression. So the regular expression for that language would be a plus B A A plus B clean it represents a set of strings this regular expression whose first symbol can be either A or B but second symbol would be A right then we have to write a regular expression representing a set of all strings which ends with A Then the regular set uh, expression corresponding to this language would be A plus B clean and then A. Now suppose we have to write a regular expression for a set of strings having ABA as a substring. Then it would be A plus B clean ABA 
a plus b claim. This regular expression represents the set of all strings which have ABA as a substring. Now we have to write a regular expression which represents all strings which starts with A and ends with B. Then it would be A, A plus B clean and B. Right? Now we have to write set of all strings started with substring AB. Then it would be AB, A plus B clean. Thank you very much.